Hey guys, welcome to this another Tech Byte with Cloud Devta. Today let's talk about Generative Adversarial Network, that is GAN. So GAN, or the Generative Adversarial Network, uh, is designed for unsupervised machine learning. It is the main technology behind the generative AI that we know today. So Chat GPT, Bard AI, Cohort, and all other generative AI models work uh, through this GAN. So if we understand this, uh, it comprises of three words, generative, adversarial, and network. So G, generative AI, it's very similar to the generative AI. It's a framework for the generative AI where it is able to generate images, audio, video, and other similar content. With A, it means the adversary or the competition between two neural networks where N uh, depicts those two neural networks. So there are two neural networks here that we talk about. One is the generator and then there is a discriminator. So the competition or the game that we have here is called a zero sum game where there are two participants, two neural network. One is called a generator. Generator has got the task of generating the synthetic data which resembles the real data. So whatever data we feed in, it tries to generate the data around that and it's always synthetic. It's not the real data. Discriminator on the other hand has got the job to decide if the data generated by generator if it is real or synthetic or fake. So this is what both these uh, competitors have got. Now let's talk about the objective of this game. So the objective is that generator aims to improve his ability to generate the synthetic data as close as the real data so that it can fool anyone observing that data, right? Whereas discriminator has got the task or it is aim at improving its ability to correctly identify the generated data as real or fake. It should be very able, clearly able to tell every time that the data is real or fake. So this goes on for multiple iterations till the time. Now, how the game ends? So the end game or the end of the game comes at the point when the generator network is able to fool the discriminator network and discriminator is no longer able to distinguish between the real and you know the fake or synthetic data that has been generated by the generator. So that is the point where this game ends and the GAN is able to give that particular data that we actually desire as a part of output which is very real, very very much uh, you know near to a real data that we aspire. So this is Generative Adversarial Network, a very core technology behind the generative AI that we were talking about previously. There is another video which uh, talks about the generative AI if you have not seen it uh, already. So please watch it. Thanks for joining. I'll see you next time.